The Beaumont Public Library System presents stories. Today I'm going to read the short giraffe. Hmm. Most giraffes aren't short, are they? Well, Boba the baboon had come to take a photo of the tallest animals in the world. The giraffes were very excited. They wanted it to be Perfect. And perfect it was. Except for one tiny problem. Who's that? It was Jerry the shortest giraffe who ever lived. I'd better stay out of the photo, said an embarrassed Jerry. I don't want to ruin it for the rest of you. Out of the photo? Don't be silly, said Stretch, the tallest of the giraffes. We'll just have to find a way to get you up to our level. So they tied Jerry to stilts, but he bobbled, he wobbled, and crashed to the ground. That didn't work. They stacked him on turtles, but the shells were too round. They hung him from branches, but he was upside down. They filled him with helium, like a balloon, oh my goodness. But he floated away like a balloon. They tried giving him wings, but giraffes are not meant to fly. They even tried springs, but Jerry just bounced and bounced and bounced all around. The giraffes had run out of ideas. Mm, look at all these pictures, and none of them came out very good. Then a caterpillar who'd been watching the whole thing finally spoke up. Excuse me, giraffes. If I might say, instead of trying to get Jerry up to your level, wouldn't it be easier if you bent down to his? The giraffes knew at once that the caterpillar was right. They got ready for the photo one more time. Oh, I like the way that looks. And it was the most perfect photo ever. What do you think? That was pretty good, huh? There's the baboon. Say cheese. And that was the story of the short giraffe. I hope you liked it. It's one of my favorites. See you next time.